firm and go slowly then relax. Right. We measure things with our tiles. Okay. So when we measure things with our tiles, did we lay them out like this? No. Why not? Because it wasn't it wasn't it wouldn't be correct, would it? What made it correct? By putting them together. <laughs> By putting them together. They had to touch in order to be the right way. Okay. So Remember, we also talked about the word about. Because if I had a crayon and it looked like this, this was about three tiles long, right? It's not exactly three tiles long, but it was about, okay? But it's closer to three tiles than it is to two tiles. Okay, so guess what we're going to do today? We're going to measure again. Are we going to use the same source? No. No, what are we going to use today? We are going to use paper clips. Okay, Sid and Allie measured the same pencil. Sid says it's about four paper clips long. Allie says it's about three paper clips long. Circle the name of the child who measured correctly. Measure correctly. The Sid? Sid yeah. Would you guys agree that Sid measured correctly? Yes. Why did Sid measure correctly? How do you know that Sid measured correctly? Because she put them together and Allie put them on. She put them together like that. Very good. You are exactly right. Sid made sure that the paper clips touched. And Allie spread them apart too far. So we need to make sure that they touch. Okay. Also, first grade, I want you to take a look at this black line. Did both Allie and Sid start the same way? No. Yes. Yes, they did. Is it important to start where the object is starting? Yes. Why? So you get the answer right. So we get the answer right. Just like, remember how we talked last week? Whenever we're starting a race, we want it to be fair, right? Do you get to start a little bit ahead of me? No. No, why not? Because that's too easy. Well, it's, it's not, not fair. It's not a race to get anywhere. Okay. So, we always start at the same line. So, that's exactly like whenever we're measuring objects. Whenever I'm measuring this pencil, the pencil starts right here. So, I want my measurement to start right there as well, so that I can for sure measure it correctly. Okay, how many paper clips did Allie use? How many did Allie use? She only used three. How many paper clips did Sid use? Very good. So they're different answers. Should they be different answers? Yes. No. No, they shouldn't. So one of them is incorrect. So we need to be careful when we are measuring that we that they are lined up exactly how Sid has them lined up and they start in the same spot. Okay? 